I'm disappointed that the uh, two-hour rule was invoked to shut down this hearing before we could hear from Mr. Browder's testimony yesterday. Mr. Browder has traveled from overseas to be here today to testify about the Russia's efforts to manipulate our government and media. This is an important topic uh, to discuss. Uh, if the uh, other party is truly serious about getting to the bottom of the <coughs> Russian interference, they should hear him out. Uh, Mr. Browder, I thank you very much for uh, changing your travel plans to be here. This committee uh, very much appreciates your willingness to stay over a day. Uh, I'm going to introduce items into the record, uh, three in number. The first is a statement by the president of the Human Rights Foundation. In it, he alleges that he and others uncovered a $2 billion corruption scheme involving Venezuela government and a foreign company laundering money through J.P. Morgan. He claims that the foreign company hired Fusion GPS, which then created dossiers containing false information to smear the whistleblowers involved, planted slanderous news items, and intimidated journalists who were going to report on the corruption scheme. The second item is an article by Lee Smith titled, Fusion GPS Illustrates the Brave New World of Manufactured News for hire, end of quote. The third item is a New York Times article titled, Soviet veteran who met with Trump Jr. is a master of dark arts, end of quote. That article describes the activities of a Russian-American lobbyist named in Mr. Browder's Foreign Agents Registration Act complaint. So without objection, those would be included in the record. Um, I would... Uh, like to introduce uh, into the record, uh, Senator Crapo has a constituent who would like to submit written testimony about his experience with Fusion GPS for the record. Without objection, uh, uh, he may do so within one week from today. I also want to insert a letter from Airline Pilots Association alleging that the U.S. Travel Association has not properly registered under FARA. That letter alleges the association engaged in political activities on behalf of foreign state-owned airlines in the Middle East. So without objection, I, I will do that. And now I'll let uh, the ranking member make any statement she has, and then I will introduce and swear our witness. Go ahead. Thank